round in Group B. The final game will be later this evening as Australia take on Italy. And Fiji kicked long downfield to get this game started. The ball taken by Lachlan Wormsley. It's central in the arms now of Sandrugu at loose forward this afternoon, keeping it alive, playing on, says the referee, there goes Sims! Sims right on the spot, held up, says the referee, 10 metres out, Corisau, centre of the field, Bunny Iowa drives forward, no! going close now of Fiji, oh getting the big forwards to do the work, Corisau again, moving out towards the left-hand side, looping ball, taken back by Kiko in the end, I think the possession forced out of the arms, oh. Corisau again, to Wakeham, combining through the middle, Miranda, Miranda, stutters Miranda. a little, changes Miranda. his mind which way he's going, and the tackle's completed, in there is Sam Luckley, oh. back in the side after missing the game against Australia with illness, but Fiji looking dangerous, now at the middle, that's the first try of the game, I think it's Sandrugu, the scorer, and Fiji open their account for the afternoon, yeah, it was just particularly against Italy in round one. Big oh, hits going in there, huge hits. Hits. huge hit coming in from the uh, Fijian forward. Honey Iowa just gets in between players. And Fiji rolling forward, looking nicely there with the oh. ball, and there's a breakthrough, oh, it's Ryan Louie going through, he's got support from Kikau, and Kikau touches down behind the post, it was coming again, you could feel it with the possession, Fiji score. Well, Henry, where, where, Rewa Louie, sorry. He dazzled everybody in this stadium there, because I even lost sight of the ball. Here goes Corisau, the middle of the field. Possession with Sandrungu. Two. Pressure oh. really being put on that line by the Fijians. Out to Wakeham. Wakeham has got the runners coming around him. The space out on the right-hand side as well. Nagama, oh, tries the offload. Out on the far side, Karawalevu not quite ready for it, and the ball goes into touch. Here's Corisau out along the line, keeping it moving, a space out wide, taken by Wormsley go. on his own ten. Wormsley's in the clear. I don't think the Virginians are going to catch him. It'll be his second try of the tournament. Scotland's second try of the tournament, and Wormsley goes in for Scotland. Well, he's just picked the pocket there, hasn't he? Lachlan Wormsley. To withstand again from the Fijians in their own. 20 metre line, oh what a run going forward there from Fiji! And is that another try? Is Tarubi there. got that ball down? No he didn't. No try given. Distance for that last set from them was better wasn't it with the ball but they're in trouble here as Nagama breaks now. Yeah Nagama's in the clear, he's got one man to beat, David Dixon's there and he's beaten. Backwards, backwards, backwards. The ball has come out, he's gone to ground. The ball is played back inside, long and deep to Wakeham, who puts the kick in over the top. A tester again for Wormsley. He takes it cleanly, passes that test. Scotland with possession. Keeping it moving. Fiji trying to get that momentum again to Wakeham. Out wide, space for Fiji. It looks like another try going in. What a tackle coming through, doing just enough to make sure that try line stays intact. But Scotland still having to work. The ball comes back for Fiji to the centre of the field. The kick comes in. Again from Wakeham underneath it, Wormsley again, he's missed it, straight into the arms of the Fijians. And Henry Rayman Louis is the man that collects it and benefits, and the try is given. Well, he set the try up earlier, didn't he, Rayman Louis? Well, what have Scotland got here, yeah. Sharon? First time we've seen this. Very, them. very close to the line now. There goes Ferguson, tries to charge forward, let his strength do the job. Good work by the Fijians, dragging him back two or three metres in that tackle. Here's Schneider to Bell. Rubber kick goes through, oh. a space there, and Scotland are in. It's Ben Helliwell with the try, and the celebrations have started for the Scots. Well, my word, it's game on. What a beautiful way to kick it was from Bell. It almost looked like, as the nine jumps out, that they've all missed the play. There, and look what happens off the next carry. As a penalty. It looks like Luke Bain's been sent to the stands for ten. So Scotland's task just made a little harder now, they're down. Towards the centre of the field. Bunny Ayo again, doing the job that he did so well and effectively in the opening stages of the first half, but look at that defence from That's Scotland brilliant. again. One. That's encouraging. Great work from the Scots. Touch tries to raise a hand, tried to swat off a Scott defender there. And this is the last of the set. Will they find space out wide? They're moving it towards the corner, and there go Fiji. And that's a try for the Fijians, Mike Acevo in at the corner, simply
gentle hands in the end, leading to the first try of the second half. Wickham with the kick, it's high again, it's spinning, yeah, and it's going to be an awkward bounce as well. Oh, and it's messed up by Dixon. And that could be costly for the Scots with that drop out to come. Fiji keeping it moving, trying to find gaps as the gap out wide again. Kick out keeps it going with an interception. Oh, the chance again. Score. And it's Lear with the ball. It's going to be hauled down though, but what a reliever of pressure that interception was from Bailey Liu for Scotland. And it's the Scots now that try and get some momentum with Wormsley. He's brought down just outside the 40. If Scotland can score from this position, it goes out, keeping it moving from Bell. Oh, what a pass! Still through, Scotland are in! Bailey Lou, the man that started the break, finishes it for Scotland. The ball will go back, it will find the kicker. Ooh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> grabs it there from Scotland and they've got space out wide as a result with Wormsley. He sees space, he chips over the top, the defence is there but Wormsley's there to try and regather it, he can't get to the ball first and it's Fiji oh. that come up with that ball and it's Sivo with ball in hand and he just gets back into the field of play. The even end of, of such stats and numbers and figures will he end up just capitulating at the back end of games. Kikau okay. finds a gap and he goes straight through it, accelerates, will he find the try line? Just held Charles. great defence from the Scots, stopping what would have been a certain try from Kikau, but the Fijians again trying to pick up that pace and momentum, just broke down there slightly though, coming in with that ball from Wakeham. The tackle's complete. Going on the short side. Here's Nice. Good ring at the end of the Virginians. What a big hit coming in. Huge hit from the Scots. As a kick comes across field from Fiji, looking for space. It can't be taken by Karawalevu. But wow, bodies everywhere. For your middles to do all the rest of the donkey work. <laughs> Not, that the front row. Not that you're bitter. Not that you're bitter. So here comes Fiji again, inside the Scotland 20 metre line. Tangatiwi Mua with that ball out towards Wakeham, keeping it alive. Here we go with Kikau. Kikau brought down. Fiji looking dangerous though, just gets his arm free and it's played. It goes back to Wakeham. Wakeham's got his runners out on the right hand side. Will he need them? Oh, no, he won't. Oh. And once again, Sharon, what am I going to say? You know, fine, well, it's another opportunity just gone. He's got his side, he can't get back. And that's a great shot there. I think it's James Bell. Driven back. But an offload Fiji. away. Yeah, and here goes Taruva. Still on his feet. And how many times has he had his head taken off tonight, Taruva? And look who's in the middle. He's in there. Yeah. Kick out, interested again. Yeah. Here we go. And here we are indeed with, as you put it earlier, Kyle, the cavalry piling in to try and sort things out. Taruva at the bottom of it somewhere with Wormsley. The ball's loose. Good luck to the referee, Tom Grant, in sorting this one out. This is where you don't fancy there, Joe. Not only has he had his head taken off there, Taruva, he's been trampled all over. Just down that line, please. running in. Lachlan Wormsley there. Mate, I'm going to deal with that. Wormsley must be walking on thin ice at the moment. Well, he certainly is. He is with Billy Army kick out and all. James, just help us out, pal. A little shake of the head from the Scottish winger. And it is, it's a yellow card. Sharon, it's 10 minutes in the bin. You can't really argue with it. So Lachlan Wormsley goes to the sidelines for the next 10 minutes. Scotland again on the back foot. It's a second yellow card of this half. Luke Bain spending the first 10 minutes of this second half for Scotland in the sin bin. And still, the gap is 10 points between these two sides, and it looks like we've got another one going as well here. Billy Armin Kikau getting his marching orders. Yeah. Right, that could be vital just to be sure for them. A little dart from acting half, no good for that. As Scotland read it. And there, that's it, that's the try. It's Ashton Sims as afters as well. Sorry, Corbin Sims afters as well from that try. And Sims just diving over the line. Yeah, a lovely little pass there, wasn't it? I think it was Sandragu who found himself at dummy half off the back of the play earlier there. Tangy to a moment, just jumped out and had a look there, but the short pass there from Sims and it's one on one. Yeah. He's got that balance right. But here comes Scotland outside the 10, keeping it moving out towards the left hand side. Oh, and a hand gets to it from Fiji. Karawalevu can't take it cleanly. Final five seconds and, and with that. Play on, play on. At the end of the road for Scotland, Sharon. Yeah, 
play on, shouts the referee with just second or two on the clock as that Hooter girls. Fiji win, they beat Scotland and providing there isn't a shock later with Italy beating Australia, it will be Fiji that clinch second place in Group B and progress to the quarter-finals of the 2021 Rugby League World Cup. They will meet New Zealand in the quarter-finals. But this evening, job done for Fiji. A real battle, particularly in this second half. But in the end, Fiji coming out winners by 30 points to 14.